Hi guys, this is Neil Pradeep here. We'll just check out in this video how you can root your Galaxy S GTI 9000 on double X JVT firmware. So first of all, we'll go to the article where this article is listed over here. So this is the article here, which we have covered it on AndroidAdvisors.com. So we have mentioned here what is routing and what are the advantages, its advantages and also the procedure to reclaim the warranty or re revoke the root taxes. So this let's proceed to the next page. So this is a zip file which you need to download it in your computer. So since we already have it, we will not be downloading it right now. Once the file is downloaded, and if it prompts you to enter the password, so enter the password as AndroidAdvisors.com. So unzip the same, and after that, open the Odin. So keeping the Odin open in your computer, you now need to connect your phone with the help of USB cable which I've got at the time of purchase. So this is a Galaxy S phone which I've already turned off. Now you need to enter the download mode. So the download mode can be entered by pressing the volume down key, menu key and then just power on. So this is the download mode which I have entered. So now after this, just enter the USB cable. So as soon as you plug the USB cable. On your computer screen, you'll be seeing that the ID icon light will turn yellow in the order. That means all the drivers have been successfully updated. After this, click on PDA and just select the CA fruit package and click on open. So now after checking the same this package, just click on start. After that, you will see that the process will be completed within a minute. And in the meanwhile, in the order you will be seeing that the phone will be rebooted so here you will see that the galaxy logo is being flashed and in the Odin you will see that the pass has been done that means the phone has been successfully rooted so now you are seeing that the phone is being rooted So it will take some time on the S logo for the first time and as in the time progresses. So here you go, the phone is being rooted. Just to check on whether the phone has been rooted successfully or not, you need to go into applications. Still the phone is loading. Just let the media scanning to be finished. So now it has been finished. Just click on applications, go to settings, and then about phone. That will show the version of the phone. Now you will see that there are three icons that CWM, Super User, and Tweaks. So that means the phone has been successfully rooted. You need to allow the access to the CWM application. So that's it. The phone has been successfully rooted. Stay tuned for Android devices for more.